Welcome to our Advent Daily Devotions here at Our Savior's Lutheran Church in Long Beach on this Monday, December 13th. Our reading for today is the first chapter of Luke, verses 46 through 49. My soul magnifies the Lord, and my spirit rejoices in God my Savior, for he has looked with favor on the lowliness of his servant. Surely from now on all generations will call me blessed, for the Mighty One has done great things for me, and holy is his name. And our quote to ponder for today, Those who sing praise do not just praise, but also praise joyfully. Those who sing praise do not just sing, but also love the one to whom they are singing. In the praise of those who confess in public proclamation, and in the song of those who love is loving affection. Augustine, Exposition on the Psalms 71. The Roman Catholic Church's catechism includes the saying, the one who sings prays twice. Sometimes credited to Augustine, it is at best loosely based on the longer quote above that we pondered. But the saying still rings true. Sung prayer is somehow richer, deeper, more profound. In today's text, Mary begins a song called the Magnificat, Latin for magnifies. She enters a long legacy of biblical women who praise God's victories in song. Remember Miriam, Deborah, Hannah. These women don't just sing songs. They are active agents in God's victories. And their songs focus not on themselves, but on God. Do you sing praise to God? When? What songs? You don't need great talent to hum along, to join in somehow, or to find beauty in music. To God's ears, your voice is the same as everyone else singing. And along with Mary, we can try singing some praises to God. Let us pray. My soul proclaims your greatness, Lord. I sing my Savior's praise. You looked upon my lowliness, and I am full of grace. Now every land and every age this blessing shall proclaim. Great wonders you have done for me, and holy is your name. Amen. <laughs>